kind of the team we are and uh, I mean we came to the game as an underdog. Croatia was a favorite. They are when they are on, they are probably one of the most talented teams in Europe. But you know, they are also a team that when you get them under pressure, they they fall apart and I think that's what happened to them today a little bit. I mean we got to a 10 point lead, 15 point lead and you know they started to be down, they started to talk between each other, you could hear it on the court. So uh, that was our advantage and we took we took advantage of it. What dream did you see yesterday? <laughs> and what dream you expect to see tonight? I had no dream, but you know, this morning I was speaking to my uh, to my girlfriend who's back home with our little daughter, and I told her, I'm gonna call you this afternoon, and either we're gonna be in the quarterfinals of the European Championship, or I'm gonna be in uh, in the retirement of the national team. Uh, so I'm looking forward to the phone call because we are still in the tournament, and my my career with the national team is still going. Do you choose uh, Serbia or Finland? <laughs> Uh, it's tough to go against Serbia. They so far undefeated. Uh, you know they won the the, the the group of death in in Berlin, and they have a great team. They are. Uh, But they say if you if you win big teams, you're gonna take the medal. <laughs> That's true. We are in the quarterfinals, so you're not gonna face easy teams. Uh, it's gonna be a tough game for us. Great, uh, uh, great matchup, and uh, you know we'll be fighting like we did today, and we'll see what happens. Okay, a strange question. Uh, except uh, Czech Republic, uh, 